Today, we're diving into a simple yet effective process to clear all cache from your Windows 11, whether it's version 10 or any other Windows computer. Trust me, it's a straightforward task that can significantly enhance your computer's performance. Stick around until the end of the video, as I'll explain why this can make your computer load faster. To kick things off, press the Windows key and the R key together. This opens up the run window. Step 1. Clearing prefetch. In the run window, type prefetch and hit OK. Now, select any file, press Ctrl plus A to choose all files, and then press Shift plus Delete to permanently delete these unnecessary files. Confirm by clicking Yes. Step 2. Tackling temporary files. Next, press the Windows and R keys again, but this time type temp and hit OK. When prompted, click on Continue. Clear out any lingering temporary files using the same Ctrl plus A and Shift plus Delete process. Step 3. Clearing another cache location. Now, for an extra cleanup, press Windows plus R again and type percent temp percent before hitting OK. This takes you to another cache location where you can select all files. Press Ctrl plus A and then Shift plus Delete to eliminate more unnecessary data. Some of the files may not be deleted, but that's perfectly fine. You can just leave them as they are. When you select do all this for current items and skip, there might be a few files and folders that won't get deleted. This is because those files are currently in use by some programs, but it's not a problem. Feel free to leave them be. Step 4. Disk Cleanup For the final step, press Windows plus R once more and type clean MGR all together. Hit OK. And this opens up the disk cleanup tool. Select the drive where your operating system is installed, usually the C drive, and check all the options like recycle bin, temporary files, thumbnails, and delivery optimization files. Click OK to initiate the cleanup. Congratulations! By following these steps, you've successfully wiped out all the accumulated junk from your computer, resulting in a cleaner and faster system. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe for more tutorials. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one. Have a wonderful day!